Hi, I'm Mag, and last week I went back to Enemy Defenders to obtain the very overpowered Secret Dragon Mage, because Loki, the most recent updates have been pretty solid, so it was a nice change of pace. But my boy Dragon Mage isn't the most OP unit anymore, and that title goes to Gilgamesh, a secret from the World 2 banner. So I also had to go back and obtain him. And let me tell y'all, this is my luckiest Enemy Defenders video, I think. But just yesterday, by the time I'm recording this, I got the Dragon Mage which is super super op and somehow a negative 732 of him exist very cool but with the release of this second world they released an even more op unit gilgamesh and he's right there you can't see him but he's right there when the update first dropped it was like impossible to get these units because getting the coins was so 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 tough but after they allowed you to convert as much as you want which by the way you need to click 2000 times per day very cool i got all the coins needed 48,000 is exactly how much you need for pity so we're gonna be getting yoga mesh right now no need for super lucky no need for lucky potion and get him fully fully done i spent the past couple of days farming to get this where is it Rainbow stars, dude. Rainbow stars are insane. All right, let's go. We have the summon 50. I will only likely get the pity. If I do end up getting him before the pity, we'll see. But my expectation is that I'm gonna have to summon 6,000 times, so I'll be here for a while. Okay, we got our first mythic uh, from the pity, of course. I've never seen it before. Shadow Conjurer. Oh, apparently he's really good. He's like the fourth highest on the DPS chart. Maybe I'll get a shiny on this video. Oh, 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 it was not pity. Whoa, it resets. I still have 25,000 coins. Let's go. That saved me like 30 minutes. <laughs> What's his pass? It inflicts bleed effect. Oh, he's a bleed unit. Wait, the demon lord is a demon buffer. Mmm, you probably need to run them both together, huh? I want to I evolve him right now. Let me uh, morrow his stats. Starting to get low on risky dice. Come on. All right, dude, four risky dice left. Yeah, he does need a radiant crown. Just making sure. Because uh, I accidentally did craft an arcane orb. And I'm never going to use it. That was such a waste of rainbow stars. There we go. My <laughs> negative three exist. Cosmetic. Ooh. Listen, I do feel like Yogamesh. Man, like the thing is, it's only the hair color. If he if he was blonde, no one would question who the, who he is. But you know, it is what it is. Right, I want to see what he does. He's level one, uh, zero traits. I don't care. I don't. I don't care to see the damage. I care to see like animations and uh exactly what he does is he a hybrid unit he is okay even with the changes where like some characters take more damage or less damage depending if it's like ground or hybrid i still think hybrid units are always gonna be better right so he does the bleed from placement already yeah i think i'm gonna try him out later with the bleed buffer he does the uh the gilgamesh portals or whatever you'd call that light of swords yep that's pretty good this one is just like a comical sound effect. Light barrage. Yeah, I think they did this this uh, Gilgamesh rendition actually pretty good. Gates of Babylon. It's a big circle, and uh, yeah, the portals open up, and the, the it's more like laser beams that's coming out, but it's it's supposed to be <laughs> weapons. It still looks pretty good on three times speed. Although, listen. If I'm grinding, I'm playing with no effects, so. Last attack is a Light Destroyer. Yeah, it is gonna destroy my <laughs> my eyes, oh my god. This is supposed to be a Numa Elish. Let me see it in, uh, in one time speed. Yeah. Turco, can you play a, a clip of uh, FGO Gilgamesh doing Enuma Elish? It somewhat looks like it. Yeah, I'm gonna level him up first, and then we'll, we'll get Almighty. I think I'm also... I didn't check if I got a shiny version of the Mythic. I'm also gonna give him a trait as well. I wanna try that one as well. He's like fourth fourth placement in DPS charts. That's that's pretty good. By the way, my longtime YouTube sponsor, Gamersubs, did a big drop yesterday, and I kind of forgot to include it in the last video. So hopefully, if you're interested, it's still in stock. So make sure to use code NAG for 10% off at checkout. Link is in the description. I 
drink their energy drinks every day to get me through the insane grinds and I need to make sure they keep sponsoring me because then they keep sending me free caffeine and the cycle continues. <laughs> All right, it took a while, but I got him level 80. I would go to my private server so I can reroll for last lag, but unfortunately I can't tether him to bring him to the world one and world two does not have private servers. So that's sick, man. In any case, as always, we're looking for the 0.1 almighty on him. He's a true placement unit, so almighty is best. Apparently... Whoa! 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 No! <laughs> mm. <laughs> that is nuts! Sonic Almighty? The only thing better would be legitimately Almighty Requiem. That's it. This is the best you can roll possible. Dude, I don't even want to know how much DPS he has. And he's a slow hitting unit as well. <gasps> Dude, how many rolls did I do? Like five? Now I just need uh, Crimson Spirit. What? I got Divine? Isn't there one that's rarer than Divine? Where is it? It doesn't show. That is nuts. Is this my first double trait almighty? No, it's not, because uh, Shadow Dragon has a Brawler 3 almighty. I rolled on him. Crimson Spirit. That is nuts. So I also brought uh, the Demon Overlord. I'm guessing now the Demon Overlord is a good unit, because he sucked before, but he uh, buffs. All units within range have their bleed damage increased by 50%. I can't believe it was so fast. I did like four rolls or, or whatever it was, like five rolls. I wanted to evolve this guy, but I need like one more Rainbow Star. Listen, Rainbow Stars, they're not gonna happen, but he does look pretty good. Like fourth place and he does burn. So if I have Dragon Mage, I off his burn that's like a crazy team i have here it's like uh we have the <laughs> Sonic Almighty. we have the bleed mega dps and then we have the bleed buffer if i want to roll almighty on him dude i i, I rolled almighty so fast i kind of want to try yeah i think so he's he's three placement he's three placement but here's the thing right if i'm doing a portal or like a raid. It's not like I'm gonna upgrade three of them. So I have so many rerolls left. I want to get the bleed buffer from my guy with Almighty as well. And now is when it takes forever for me to get something. <laughs> Wait, can't I just do this in World One? I can't because he's a World One unit. Yep. Listen, the lag of not being in a private server is too much for me. While I have said, you know, the the unit, the main unit of this video, what's his name in game? Radiant King. We all knew it was Gogamesh like directly. Every time I ask who the Demon Overlord is, I get a different answer. I swear. It's either uh, the guy from Demon Slayer, or it's like th there was like four, four or five different people that this guy is supposed to be, and I still don't know. What I do know is that the last video guy, also, like, wherever I would look, it would be a different answer. The, uh, this guy right here, the Dragon Mage, apparently... Okay, I... I the trait button is in front of his face. It's a guy from Fairy Tale. You know, I need to read Fairy Tale. I'm currently read Undead Unlock. I think once I'm done with that, I'll read Fairy Tale. Undead Unlock is like actually low key underrated. Only AWTD has uh, Undead Unlock units. No other game has it, as far as I've seen. I already got Requiem. It's calling for me, but I will not take it. Another Requiem. Wait, right here it says, right? Two times trait, trait lock active. Yesterday, when I roll on Dragon Mage, I swear he didn't say that. I'm pulling up my own video. Another Oh, he did. I'm just, I'm just stupid. And yeah, now the defenders has this uh, two times straight luck thing on the weekends. I, on, I, I'm only uploading after weekends or during weekends. This game. Almighty, let's go, bro. What a crazy run. I know I'm not evolving the other banner character right now, but I'm also give him the spirit. Man, I really want to, but like, there's nothing I can do. Maybe I can buy one. I feel like that's gonna be really hard to find. I wish this game had like Pet Sim 99, where you can look. Like, if I go here, I click and then teleport to a lobby that has one selling. That would be huge. Oh, but he's not evolved. Ah, I want one evolved. Yeah, like this guy is selling one like unevil as well. Like no, no one wants to sell them evil because evolving characters is such a pain because the rainbow star is just so impossible to get. Just one rainbow star is so, it just feels so impossible. Yeah, one, I mean, this is not even shiny, so I don't, I don't even want it, but I hacking love time gated stuff. I love it. Well, whatever. It was, oh, I wasn't even planning on evolving him today. I'll, I'll evolve him whenever I, I get another rainbow star. This might just stay as my world true team because I can't, bring any more units oh no 
It can't be because uh, I almost forgot. I need my, my you know, the 500 cost placement. Yeah, I need him. Gotta, gotta deal with the early wave somehow. All right, so while looking at his damage, I gotta keep in mind that the bleed deals 25% of the damage, right? And we have two bleed buffs. One from the Crimson Spirit in increases the bleed damage by 50 Bro, I'm trying to look. I'll do the regen. Bleed cancels regen. Increases the bleed damage by 50%. And then this guy is also increasing his bleed damage by 50%. So do I just assume bleed is 50% of his damage? I'm not sure. However, it is 20k placement. I'm gonna compare him to Shadow Dragon. Well, Shadow Dragon attacks slower. We attack very fast, you know, we got Sonic. <laughs> How expensive is he? I'm just gonna max him out because I want to see his damage. We're already seeing the animations and stuff. As a quality of life, it would be nice if there was an indicator to the bleed damage, like in ALS, but you know, it is where it is. Is it the last upgrade? Oh, he is really not that expensive to max. 245k, I'm gonna ignore the, the green text. Now, I'll, I'll add in. If you have two players in the, par in the party, so not me because I don't play with anyone, but you can have pink rockstar buff at all times. But let, let's round it to... Uh, 290k every 5.8 seconds plus 50 percent now let me compare it to dragon mage dragon mage do be level 85 though a shadow dragon takes so much money to max upgrade they did this mistake with uh the portal units the lunar girl takes like infinite amounts of money they really wanted these units to be like only used on infinite runs which uh, i mean i guess there was a bigger emphasis on leaderboards than in other games but i don't know i feel like what this game really needs is some harder but not impossible content sort of like als because whenever an update comes out it's like okay it's portals or you evil the character from the banner with uh stars from challenges which sucks because it's time gated unless you've been farming for the past couple of weeks and then you have like a bunch of rainbow stars but oh no they added a new star <laughs> so it's time gated anyways three oh let me let me add this up so 400 i'm gonna run out to 450k every 7.7 .7 seconds plus the burn which is five percent or ten percent because uh no there's no 50 percent buffer here he is the buffer they're so confusing and Gilgamesh with the Blade is doing like 435k every 5.8 seconds. He attacks faster. But Dragon Mage, he has a nuke and he's full AoE. I don't know, I think Dragon Mage is a better unit. But he's more expensive. Like how I would never max upgrade Dragon Mage in a portal. I might max up Gilgamesh. Like he, you, you can max upgrade him. All right, listen, whatever hard content they decide to release one day, I'm ready for it. I got the two strongest units in the game. And if it's in World 1, I have other strong units as well. But I can't, I can't really take them here because you know there's that pesky limiter i think i will relax on ad until next update though because uh i don't want to do more challenges god i i hate doing challenges for rainbow stars thank you for watching youtube thinks you will like the video that's showing up on screen right now and as always more content will come so stay tuned good luck